Okay, so I'm going to be going over how to set up the reset script for SSG. So you'll want to go to autohockey.com, click on download, and then download current version, and then just run this file this um, to install the program. I already have it installed, so I'm not going to reinstall it. And then you'll want to download the script itself, either in resources public of main Discord, or the same file as in resources of SSG Discord. And then I also have... Um, my GitHub here because I'll all of my minor recent changes will be here because I'm not going to re-upload this every time I make a small change on Discord. So once you have that, um, once you have Auto Hotkey installed, then have your file. Right-click on it and then hit Edit Script. I'm just going to walk through some things. So um, what you the the main things you're going to want to look at are these options. So you have your difficulty seed your key delay, which is just your time in milliseconds between each key press. And then what this does is, since there's been some issues with lag of the it getting stuck on the title screen um, because it takes a while for the world list screen to load, so then by the time it creates a new world, that screen never showed up, and the run's unverifiable. So this theoretically should fix that. It basically just waits for that screen to show up before it proceeds. But for a lot of people, this doesn't work. Um, so if your macro is getting stuck, just change this to zero. And yeah, it explains here more about that. Anyway, so you can change these to whatever you want. Um, and then down here, scroll all the way to the bottom. These are your hotkeys that you can use. So page up, for me, creates a new world. Page down, deletes the previous world and creates a new world. Home just exits the title screen and um, opens to land and purchase. So you can change these. So like if I wanted to make purge command like P, I could just make it P instead of end. But I like to keep it as, I, I don't like to use letters, so that's why I keep it as that. So um, you can go to this website right here. Again, all of this green text is shown in the script itself. And if you hit edit script, it's probably gonna open up a notepad. Um, but yeah, you can go to this website to see all the hotkeys that you can use. So anyway, so once you've customized all your settings, you can click on edits, right click again, hit run script, and then I hit page up, and then it'll create a new world. Uh, now let's say I wanna use, um, I wanna make this on um, easy difficult, or sorry, normal difficulty instead of easy. So what I can do is I hit edit script, and then just change this to normal. And then um, I close, I save, Close this file, and then in your taskbar, you'll notice there's this green auto hotkey logo, and it shows the name of the script. You'll just want to right click on that and hit reload script. Again, you only have to reload when you make a change to the script itself. So any setting, you can just change it and then hit reload script, and then um, it should work. So as you can see, this is the seed on easy because that's what it was when I ran it. So now I change the script. So let's I'll also demonstrate the page down. What this does, it d deletes the previous world. And then it, see it made this one on normal. Yeah, so um, that's about it. You can use the other two commands. They're pretty self-explanatory. The exit and then make the dragon perch. That's pretty much it. Let me know if you have any questions or anything. Cool.